Hello everybody, welcome to this special episode of Remember This Game. I'm your host Sean Conway. I play these old games so y'all don't have to. Today's episode is more of a shout out to my boys. Um, and uh, on, they, he has a YouTube channel called Fat Boys Gaming and Nonsense. So uh, he was one of my fans uh, because I, I make a lot of these ridiculous videos. So I figure... I do a follow up what he did because he went live on YouTube. Please follow his YouTube channel. I'm Fat Boy Gaming and not since his title is super long. And uh, he was playing the game called Solar Jetman. So uh, I'm gonna show you a clip of him playing the game. And this is a game that I played when I was, I don't know, I think I was 10 years old or 12, but I played this game, it's really hard. It's from Rare, and they just released this game on uh, Nintendo Switch uh, in their app store. So basically, um, he was playing the game, and this this was obviously his first time playing the game. And to me, I thought it was really unique that not only he took my request, but he played the game, and he was playing it the exact same way that I was playing it when I was a kid. Because the game doesn't really explain a lot of how you play it or anything like that. It's more like trial and error. So when he was playing, he was he didn't know about the shields and um, the upgrades to your ship and the weapons and a lot of the stuff. So it was really fascinating watching him play. And at some point, he got to it. It kind of tripped me up because towards the end of playing him and his boy, he was like, but once he got to that mindset of just putting the game down, then, you know, he went to a totally different game. So I said to myself, I'm going to play that same game, too. And I'm going to show you all what, uh, you know, um, you all need to look at his video on his channel um, because he got it saved on his uh, live. And I'm going to play through the first stage because he was struggling with the first stage. I don't blame him. I'm going to go for it as fast as possible. Like, subscribe, ring it in the bell, and I'm going to play this game right now. All right. We got this game locked and loaded. All right. This is my version of playing this horrifically bad game. Well, it's not bad. It's actually a good game. Excuse me, some hate. And I got really far in the game. If I knew what I knew now as a result, I would probably be funny. Okay. Oh, uh, that's a password system. I wish I knew that when I was a kid. So, basically, you're a ship. I guess it's damage or whatnot. I'm trying to get some upgrades. So the things that he didn't know, because the game is, is probably one of the most physically physic games for Nintendo of its time, around 1988. Uh, so it's easy to play if you understand the physics part. You don't get your shield right away, so you got, you got. That's definitely. Oh God. They're talking about I'm going to pay, play for it real fast, uh, and I got hurt in the beginning. Yep, 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 yep. I see in the beginning you don't get your shields, and, I, and that was my fault. I forgot you got you got to, like get your shields first. All right, I'm gonna go through that. Dang it! Probably just best to just shoot and your space shoot get these enemies out of the way. Alright. Uh, you know what? That thing is... It, it reminds me of... Um, those... Um, those um, things in Mega Man with the helmet. 
Uh, let me just go ahead and do this. Because you're not going to be able to go anywhere until you get um, your shields. And once I get my shields, it's pretty much a wrap. I can go through this real quick. So, uh... Sometimes I don't try to rush it. I try to um, let my ship kind of like it. it uh, kind of I kind of let the physics do its thing. When he was doing it, he was struggling. Oops! That thing did not disconnect. go underneath it and then you kind of want to propel yourself up and there we go yeah now I got the shield now but my ship is like already damaged so like in situations like this when your ship is kind of damaged a little bit I, I would just go on down Here's going shields up and let's get the other parts. There's a diamond. Uh, I'm gonna get the diamond. What you can do, you don't really need to go to the ship. Oops. time comes. My ship is damaged, so I might as well go ahead. Yep, yep. Shields up. But the shields, I can bump in all over the place, so... And not take too much damage. And you're going to need it, because when they fire at you, it is one hit, and it's a wrap. play this game a lot in order to be able to move the way I do when I was a kid and it's amazing because I, I still it, that feeling hasn't really gone away but it took such a long time for me to know where I was going and stuff games like this really needed like in-game um, direction or arrow something 
shields back up. But the shields are not going to spin around. They're not going to go back to the spot. Alright, fire all torpedoes. One of the things he did in his video, he, he went through that, but if you got the shields on, it won't let you go through that. Oh, hold up. Oops. I want to go down. And now I want to go up, up. See Daisy. this thing in such an awkward position. Damn. Woo! I think he did that part faster than I did. Alright. Shields up. Let's get on out of here. Now I'm back to the ship. like a weird mix of Metroid meets I don't know this was this was a hit of its time and in fact this game is also in the, um, the rare collection uh, the, uh, the Xbox and they have some other games now with each one of these parts that you put in your little shuttle pod it, it allows you to be more powerful and, and uh, more stable engine, map device, the map device that you know where you're going, efficient in, uh, in engine, titanium bullet, time bombs, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get this because flying is difficult, equip the pod, that, uh, oh hold up, hold up, can I equip the pod with it? Tougher and 
It's just, there's a lot. There's a lot of fetching. See Daisy. All right. Got some fuel. I wonder how much fuel do I need to find? Boom, 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 boom. I'm like a pinball game. Oh shoot. get all, all the um, upgrades on your shuttle pod, you be able to fly like this, which makes this game so much easier. But until then, you kind of like just float. That one little uh, uh, rocket booster in the back literally is the only thing that's propelling, propelling you where you need to go. Give it more of a realistic Oh, 
Oh, cool. There's a witch caller over there. So, I don't have to go all the way back. Starting to drag you all the way down. You want to release it? Grab it all over again. Uh, yeah, I think I we got this. And toss me all the way back to the beginning but that's so legit man i'm only going to play it that much because just like him i feel the same way like subscribe ring it in the bell and i will see you on the next late uh, video peace thanks for watching please help support me so I can keep doing more videos. Also leave a comment, thanks.